Hi, sweetie. Yeah, how, hi. Are, how are you today? Fine, thanks. Good. Okay. So today we're going to do the reading test. It's a practice test, okay? So we're going to read and choose the best answer, okay? Okay. All right. Let's start with part one. Let's start with this one here. Let's do the example first, all right? Yes. Okay, let's read number one. This is the first care expression. You do, you do this when you are happy. Facial, is it? facial expression. Yeah. Facial. Expression, yeah. So it's expression with your face, what you do with your face. Okay. Facial expression. When you are happy, what do you do when you are happy? Smile. Yes, very good. You smile. Okay, there we go. You smile when you are happy. Okay, let's have a look at number two. When you are making, you miss the butter and heat it in the oven. When you make, <coughs> when you make cake. You mix the batter and heat it in the oven. When you heat something in the oven, what do you do? Mm. <coughs> um, <coughs> I'm baking. I'm baking, yes. I'm baking. Okay. What does frying mean? If I want to fry something. Um, I fry food, then I'm busy with oil. You put the, the food in oil to fry it, to make it crispy from the outside. Then you fry it. And when you boil it, you want the inside to be nice and soft. So then you boil it in water. So when your mommy does the potatoes, she will boil them in water. And if you want to make it nice and crispy, then you'll use the oil. Okay. You understand? Yes. Okay. Let's go to number three. The, is it the type of food that consists of the small white or brown bread? Grain. It becomes soft after boiling, boiling and steaming in the water. And um, I think it's the number C. Noodles? Yes. Okay. Um, it's a type of food consists of small white or gray, as brown grains. Now, noodles are thin and long. They're not small and white gr brown grains. Noodles are thin and thin and long. So what do you think it is now? It's rice. Rice. Oh. Rice. Okay. Let me show you a picture quickly. Okay. Um, here it is. Do you know what rice is? Yes. Okay. There it is. It's rice. It's small oh. white or brown grains. Okay, rice. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, let's do number four, five, and six. I'm going to make it smaller. There we go. Okay, read number four. It is an even way. People the event. Yeah. Ah. Earn that money to have all the people are. Mm. 
exists as well. Okay, it is an event where people donate money to help other people or organizations. So okay. donate, what do you think donate means? Donate. They donate money means they give money away. They give it. They give away. Do you see? Yes, I can okay. see it. They give it away. So it's an event that people will give it away. Um, see, right? Yes, it's a fundraiser. A fundraiser is when they give it away. Bertha, what is graduation party? Mm. I don't know what this is. Graduation party is when you finish your university, when you finish studying and you want to go work now, then you have a graduation party. When you finished studying and you're on your way to go and work. When you finished studying, then you have a graduation party, then you graduate it. So then you are a teacher or a lawyer or a doctor. Do you understand okay. that? Okay, good. Number five, we will go back now and re review them. You get a wow on your body from an accident. Sometimes you can neither Work or no use your arm is the damage is serious. Damage serious, yes, seriously damaged. Okay. So a wound. What do you think a wound is? A wound. I, I don't know that. A wound. So and, and, and an accident, do you know the word accident? Accident, I know. Yes, okay. Now, a wound is something that you can see on your body, like a cut or a bruise where it's, where it's like blue or sometimes purple, it goes different colors. A wound you can see. So it's, not, it's painful, but if you have pain in your body, it's not a wound because you can't see it. You can only feel it. A wound is pain. It, it is sore and you, and you have pain, but a normal, like a headache, is not a wound. Do you understand the difference? Yes. Okay, so a wound is a mark on your body. It's like a cut or a blue mark, or maybe it's swollen, it's fatter than the, that it should be. So it's, it's a wound, okay? Okay. It's usually a cut where your skin is, is open. Okay, so you had an accident and he has a wound. Sometimes you can neither walk nor use your arm if the damage is serious. Damage is serious. Serious means very bad. Okay. So when you get a mark on your body and it's very bad, what happened to you then? Are you cured? injured or treated so when you knock your when you run and you fall over and you cut your arm or you cut your hand what do you what are, what happened to you then are you getting better then yeah no, no you're not getting better you only hurt yourself now so you are injured injured is when you get a cut or you broke your you break your arm it's when you get hurt that's when you injure yourself you get hurt Treated is when you go to the doctor and the doctor or the hospital make try and make you better. Then they treat you with medicine. Then the doctor try and make you better. Then he's treating you. And cured means after treated you, the wound is going away and it's getting better and you don't have a wound anymore. You don't have your cut on your arm or your hand anymore then you are cured. You're not sick anymore. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. It's when, you're, when the wound is better. Then you're cured and you can't almost see it anymore. 
Okay, number six. Let's read number six. Okay, you do this to make something look more attractive. You can do this to your room or in your home. home. Attractive means pretty. Do you want to make your house pretty? Entire house, a home is your whole house, all of the rooms. The bathroom, the bedroom, the dining room where you eat, the living room where you watch TV, the entire home, all of the rooms. Or you can make one room pretty. What do you do then? Are you breaking your house? Removing your Decorating. house? Decorating, yes, you are decorating your house. What does removing mean? Do you know the word removing? Yeah, I know. Take away or out. You remove it. You take it away from the out of the room. And breaking is when something breaks into pieces. Okay. Let's see if you can remember. What is donate if I donate money? Can you repeat that? Donate. What is donate? If I donate money, what does that mean? I don't know. Look there. I, I haven't taken it away. You can read it. Mm. <laughs> can you see it? Donate. I can't see. Oh, yeah, now I see. There. Donate. Donate is um, give it away. You give it away. What is a graduation? Graduation um, is finished studying. You when you finish studying yet? What is a wound? When it moss on your body cut a blue moss. Yes, good job. And what is serious? What does serious mean? The rest serious mean it's very bad. What is cured? If I'm cured from it. Um when the worm is and the one is better. Yes. What is injured? Interest is when you get hurt. Yes. And what is treated? When the doctor try and make you better. Yes. And what is attractive? Attractive is pretty. Um, what does removing mean? It take, take away. Yes, okay, now I'm going to do this. What is donate? Um, donate it take away. What is uh, serious? It's very bad. Yes, and what is uh, decorating? A correct thing is make it pretty. Yes. What is a graduation party? Um, it's the finish studying. Yes. And what is a what is treated? Treated um is um I don't know. <laughs> Treated is when he's uh, trying to make it better for you. He's trying to uh, make it better. And uh, uh, let's go up here. Let's go up here. What is uh, frying? If I fry something. Um, frying oil. You fry with oil and boiling. 
boiling water. Um, oh, yes, in water, okay. Um, okay, we've got that, number nine. Okay, let's read number eight. People who are a star give their product to their customer and receive money in exchange. Okay. Um, now, okay, what do you think they're doing? Um, the number A, selling. Selling. Now, people who work at stores give their products to their customers and receive money in exchange. In, in, uh, Selling. What is borrowing? When I borrow something, um, borrowing like um, like this yes um, someone gives something to you, then um, I don't know. I don't know that. When when you when you uh, borrow from somebody, you um, have to give it back. Yes. Okay. You can't take it for yourself. You have to give it back. Okay. And um, okay. Let's do number. Let's do number the next one. Number nine. Number nine, this up key, this you up please this request, Mr. on your skin too, so they are protected. Apply this mixture to your skin to protect it. What do you put on your skin to protect it? Um, protect. It's um, like a put it out of the dangerous. You try to keep it safe, yes. You want it to keep yes. it safe. Okay, good. Okay, so what do you think it is? Um, number B. Lotion, yes, it's low. Do you use lo lotion? No. I'm okay. Okay, let's um, have a look here. Um, do this for you. Okay. So selling, borrowing to take something from someone and give it back. So you do not pay for it. You take something from someone and give it back. So you do not pay for it. Flour, we use flour to bake a bread or pizza. What do we do with toothpaste? Um, toothpaste mean, um, this thing um, used to brush our teeth. Yes, good. Okay. Brush our teeth. Okay. Uh, number 10. This is a mixture of place gases that we bring. It's around the earth and doesn't have any shape or color. Okay, what is that? I want to show you what this and is. I think it's the number A, air. Air, yes. Air picking is either detached, detach or remove. Remove something. When you detach, 
or you remove something. Okay, air, yes, water and soil is the ground for the trees or flowers. Okay. What is borrowing? Borrowing is you take something from someone, you do not pay for it. Yes, yes, good. What is a lotion? Um, lotion is, <laughs> I forgot that word. You, you put on your face to your face. smooth it. Yes, to smooth it. What is toothpaste? The thing, um, is the thing that um, we need to wash our teeth. Okay, and what is um, flour? What do I use flour for? Um, flour, um, I think is. <laughs> flour we used to to make cake right yes to make cake we make cake with those okay very good and what is soil it's the ground of the tree of flour yes okay okay let's go to the next one Okay, we're gonna do number two. Okay, let's look at look at this. Number eleven. Okay. What does Thomas want to be? He wants to be the a police official. Yes. Number 12, what subject does Catherine like? She likes math. Number 13, what kind of person is Julia? Um, she is creative. I like you. Um, she likes you. Okay, number number fourteen. What does Robert not like? Um, he not like working. Working, yes, working. Working. Good job. Okay, now we're going to read the story here. Okay, dear Sandra. Can you read? Yes. Hi, how are you? I hope things are well to you. A week has passed since our summer camp and, and I still miss the fun I had there. One of the wonderful things that I love most uh, attending summer camp was making new friends like you. I had so much fun playing in the band like you. We will get busy one 
Good. Okay. Where did Jessica meet Sandra? Um, a summer camp. Summer camp. Very good. Um, okay. Summer camp. What does Jessica want to do with Sandra? Um, she wants to um, remember I wants to keep in touch with Sandra. Okay, she wants to keep in touch with Sandra. Okay, let's do one more. Up to page 104. Okay. Okay, sweetie, we're going to stop here. We did a good job today. I'm going to see you next time, okay? Okay, bye. All right, bye, bye sweetie. See you soon.